So I was actually on my way to a traditional marriage. Yay. And they dropped me at the junction and I was scared. I felt it was like it was like a no man's land. Nobody. There was nobody. Literally nobody. The only thing that gave me consolation was that shop behind me. So the sun was extremely hot. When I say hot, extremely hot. Like very, very hot. You can see the environment, no houses, nothing, nothing. So now I've, they've picked me up. So we're actually going to the house, we're going to the village. So I was actually eager to see what's, what's up now, if people were actually living inside there. Because when you cross, like you're passing through that road, you see bypasses leading inside those bushes. You feel nobody's living there, but I'm going to surprise you. You get what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying? If this is your first time on my YouTube channel, please don't forget to click the red subscribe button below and don't forget to like, comment if the video was interesting. Tell me, please. I want to I want to know. So, we kept on going. If you notice, they were clearing the bushes around due to the traditional marriage we were going to because it was a beautiful Ada other daddy yeah that was wedding so it was a traditional marriage this is the first house as you can see the very first time and i think that thing is a plant i think it's a production plant but i don't know which one and i don't know if it's still functioning but from what you can see something was actually going on there either before or it's still existing i don't know i did not stop and i did not check as you can see there's nobody there's no house so boy, your baby was scared though my sister was in front and her husband, so I felt really comfy because nothing was going to happen to me. But it's just how the place was deserted. People from around here anyway. You can see the second house. You can see the second house. So we're getting to where people are living. And you see that, I don't know what to call it. Is it the stream or what? They said that stream dries up during dry season. It's called uh, either Ngene, one Ngene or Ngenu Kud or something like that. It's, it's the stream that dries up during dry season. Is that not beautiful? I would love to <laughs> witness it when it dries up. So guys, the third house we're seeing. So I was like, there is hope. As you can see, there is um electric pole. Mean, it means that people are living there. I think. And their road is even good. Don't like some places in Imo State. Where you'll be going to, you'll be feeling so much gallop and all that. The road is good. Very, very good compared to the ones I'm seeing in Imo State for this kind of village. Have you seen people like, you're seeing houses. People are living here. But judging from what I saw initially, I didn't think anybody would live there. But I'm surprised. Activities are going on. So many things are happening. Like, it's just their self. It's so beautiful. So, so beautiful. And the nature here is so lovely. Like, so, so lovely. If you stay in this kind of village, you're ready to eat everything. They have everything. They have lots of fruits. So many fruits. So many. Lots of fruits. Coconuts. I ate a lot of coconuts. <laughs> I ate a lot of coconuts. I ate a lot. I had so much. And I think I, I tested Odara. So if you've not tested Odara, that's a balloon for this season. Just know that. Eh, 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 eh. I'm the first to test it in this village. And it's very lovely. The house be, beside the said it belongs to their former, is a compound that belongs to their former king. I think the man is late. Like that was a very long time ago. As of the 90s the igwe had this kind of house he must be a very rich man a very very rich man very rich man so we're still going at this point i got a little nervous because i wanted to see like i wanted to know i want to see now i want to get there already like if you're in my shoes i will be thinking though i was safe i knew i was safe yes because i was driving with my family I knew I was safe, but I just wanted to just get there already. I wanted to see what is happening. I've seen people live here, and I've seen there are so many fam beautiful families that are living here. So I was just eager to get going. So 
We're almost there. We're almost there. Get ready. Get ready. Get <laughs> get ready to see the venue. I'm not going to die. 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 I'm not